Aaron's gonna start. Yeah. Hey, so uh, this is the first chance we've had to make a blog with working internet, and so here's our attempt at making a video blog. So, William. Okay, so um, it's Thursday morning. Uh, so we've been here for four full days. Um, the the guys and the girls are kind of split up. So this is obviously the guys' team. We're all uh, well, actually part of our team's not here right now. Uh, our leader, uh, Melissa, she's around here somewhere. But then um, we've kind of been around uh, in the area, um, and we've been hung, we hang out, hung out at preschool and talked to some of the kids, and we've kind of been around in the slums in the area, and just uh, getting to know people and getting to uh, experience the culture and just see what uh, what guys are doing around here. So what's been okay, your favorite part so far? Yeah. I really like the, the chai tea. It's <laughs> delicious. <laughs> it's amazing. Let's do a popcorn style. When you're done, just pick someone. Yeah, I'll have to do that. Does that go? Me? Yep. Yep. What's my favorite part? No, just, just share talk. about what we're doing. Um, okay. Um, we've kind of been working with a, a, a preschool with lots of little kids and um, being able to tell them Bible stories and um, just see um, just how they learn and stuff here is kind of cool. Um, so that's one of my favorite parts, just kind of playing with the kids and stuff like that. We weren't really expecting that. So. It's Melissa! Oh, this this is the Everybody, part. this is Melissa. There she is. This Hi, is Melissa. This, uh, this is the other part of our team. And also for the record, it looks like there's something weird going on behind their head. That's actually the background. It's not a weird green screen thing. It does so, green screen. For the record, that's pretty weird. all the waving in their heads is just their misshapen heads. Oh. <laughs> Alright, what's your favorite part so far? Mm, my favorite part, kind of as I said, just playing with the children, but also kind of talking with the men uh, in the in the slums and stuff like that as well. Hayden. This is Zach picks. <laughs> Hayden. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, one of my favorite parts is um, yesterday we had breakfast with a group of men in the area. And uh, it was just a really great opportunity to get to know them, kind of live life with them, see what they were doing, and just kind of share with them why we're here and what we're doing. And it was just really encouraging to see how open they were to what we were saying. And we're doing that again as soon as we're done with this video blog. Um, and I'm just really excited to see how it happens today. I was really encouraged yesterday. You want to tell them what happened yesterday? Which part? You know. Okay, so during the men's breakfast yesterday, um, there was about, I think, about three men that showed up and then kind of two older kids. And so we got to, Aaron had the opportunity to kind of talk to them uh, about the gospel and stuff like that. And um, the pastor that we were meeting in his house, he uh, asked if any of the men wanted to come forward and that uh, he and Aaron would pray for them. Um, to kind of receive the, uh, the Holy Spirit into their hearts and the gospel. Um, and so uh, uh, two, uh, two men came, one man came forward and they got to pray for him. Um, and then one of the young boys came forward and they prayed for him. And there was also a um, current believer that um, wanted to talk to Aaron and the pastor to kind of get a further understanding on the gospel and things like that. So it was, it was really cool to see. All right, Melissa, what's been your favorite part so far? Um, my favorite part so far has been just the fact that God had just forwarded these men coming here. Um, it's just been incredible to see them interact with some of the, the men that God just set them up to minister to. Um, because obviously as women, we can't really um, do that so much. So it's been incredible watching godly men um, reach out to men in the area who are either Hindu or Muslim. And, um, and then every day with them is entertaining. So I don't think there's been one day without laughter. And it's brought a lot of a lot of joy. And there's just a lot of representation of of God between these four men. So protection, provision, joy. So it's been it's been awesome. Tell them who's your favorite. <laughs> who's your favorite team? This is definitely my favorite boys team. Yes. Yeah. Tell them how many team how many boys teams you have. This is my first boys team. Yes. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> That's why we're the best. Yeah. But hey. if y'all want to know, hey. they can fit on buses. That's technically not humanly impossible for them to get on. <laughs> That's one of my favorite parts. 
so far as we we take the public buses kind of around everywhere and they try to pack as many people in the buses as possible. And no, yes, they don't try. They do. They do. <laughs> yes, they, <laughs> they do. do. And yesterday it was a bus that was completely full. Like we were there's five of us and so we were there was like he was like get on the bus get on the bus but there's probably like two steps two steps to get into the bus that we could squeeze into. And so they kind of all get on, and there wasn't really enough room for me, so I kind of just, like, jump up and grab it. And the conductor, like, kind of holds onto the door and just hangs on the door, and we just drive off. It was... And there's a driver who's already... He's not, there's a conductor, and there's a driver. The driver's already pulling away. Yeah, the driver is very impatient. And the conductor, <laughs> and the conductor is, tries to get as many people on the bus as he can. As he's, like, running beside the bus, yeah. trying to push Zach further on, <laughs> and he jumps up behind him. Uh, it was great. It was perfectly safe. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> They've definitely been troopers, just really willing, even if I have to just be like, we're all getting on this bus, <laughs> regardless or not, if you have to hang off of it. So they have been willing. Well, today, if you guys think about it, pray for us. Um, well, especially these three guys, they are sharing their testimonies uh, at the men's breakfast again. Um, and so that'll be an exciting opportunity for them. Um, be proud of William. He um, had a big responsibility yesterday of sharing his testimony to a bunch of um, uh, former students at the preschool that we've been serving at, um, and he did an excellent job. Um, and then, you give credit to Zach because Zach's really been stepping up. Uh, he's got my back a couple times. We had a, a couple days ago. We were talking to some kids, and like I was supposed to teach them a song, and I just didn't know what to do because I think we had a translator. And Zach just stepped up and took charge, and so I'm giving him credit on this one. That was like, he's doing awesome. So, and Hayden's had a little bit of a gimpy foot, and he's. Oh. He's had a little bit of a gimpy foot, and he's actually been doing an excellent job of not complaining about it and keeping up with us because we have to walk and sometimes run or jump on buses. <laughs> and it's been doing true. great. So that's us. So um, hopefully we'll get another chance to post one with the girls. So see you later.